After a snowstorm, Bernie Sanders supporters are still turning out in droves at his rally in his hometown of Brooklyn, New York. So I've been going to a lot of Trump rallies asking supporters how they feel, and I wanted to ask Bernie Sanders supporters also how they feel, specifically about the mainstream media and how their coverage has been about Bernie Sanders. Do any of these supporters still listen to the mainstream media? And alternatively, what media sources do they actually prefer? Do you guys still consume mainstream media sources? Yeah. Occasionally. Yeah. I, I think it's like... Not, not for general news, but I think that general news in general, I mean, like, like the idea of facts and stuff like that are so hard to, to quantify in a, a modern state, you know? No, I think that mainstream media is pretty much dead right now. I, I honestly, me, I blame mainstream media for the rise of Trump because they went bananas over, like, all of their rallies just because they like the violence and all of that. So I don't really like, I don't really consume mainstream media. But I'm a person that likes seeing both sides, so I usually go for it sometimes. I even watch Braveheart, read Braveheart sometimes because I just like to be informed. I do watch CNN and Fox News because, you know, I like to get different perspective. But when I watch it, I just get disgusted because it's so untrue. The, the most mainstream media I've consumed has been in the last two weeks because he announced. I watched The View yesterday. I watched... Uh, God forbid. <laughs> I watched Seth Meyers uh, the other night and I watched... Uh, CNN when he had the town hall, but mostly it is definitely not mainstream media. Bernie Sanders campaign is what turned me off to the mainstream media, so now I get a lot of my news sources from places like the Young Turks or NPR or AP News and sources that I wouldn't have otherwise considered. From them not disclosing the, who who was um, asking him the questions on CNN to like the Washington Post having like four straight stories of against him on the day he announced his presidency. I don't really follow them anymore, just the Young Turks. I do, but only for comedy. You know, I just watch it and laugh, you know. That's why I watch you and like other uh, progressives on YouTube, mostly. Um, I mean, you know, the mainstream newspapers, New York Times, Washington Post, whatever, but uh, I also look at a lot of independent stuff like Dem Democracy Now!, you know, I check out Young Turks, um, all kinds of other websites. I, I just don't really trust any particular website or particular source as the sole source. So what are your preferred media sources then? Um, the Young Turks, obviously. You gotta watch TYT with Chink, uh, John, and Anna. They're the best. I love And them. Emma, come on. And Emma, yes, of course, Emma. Yeah, please, man. And typically, it would be uh, feeds through Facebook. So the Young Turks comes up often. I'd probably say, honestly, that's the biggest one, is the Young Turks. I just want to say I love the Young Turks. Uh, I watch your show all the time. You guys are the true progressive channel. Uh, shout out to Cenk and shout out to Anna.